You can start it if you want to. I'll be right back. About red set to pop here. I'm gonna take myself off of the phone thing. You do realize that I'm not here, right? Yeah. What do you mean? Of course you're here. You're always here between for the last. Yeah, but uh, I went. I went to get my coffee. Okay, so <clears throat> everyone else is here. <clears throat> Me too. I gotta. gargle a little bit. I'm getting, I have a little frog in my throat. I hate that. You ever get those, those times in the day where you what just did can't you do? clear your Why, throat? Uh, Paul, get back hmm. into the meeting. We'll mess up the, the layout. We just discussed this. I think you're improvising. I can't no. understand what's going on. You left, oh, seriously? The, you left oh, the Zoom geez. meeting. Oh gosh. Okay. Sorry. How did I leave the Zoom meeting? I'm still. Oh, the other one. Okay. I see. Yeah. I see. I see. Okay. Gotcha. We just That's thought about around. this. I didn't th know you needed my thing to be there, though. But we just talked about, you know, to do the Roberta thing, of having it in addition oh. to your. Sorry. Coming back. Oh, we have thirty seconds. Oh, and I have to put in the time, the, the passcode. <laughs> Jesus. Let me find it really quick. CWC, we do everything at the last minute. Exactly. Uh, 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 you know, I can always change the timer. Uh, uh, yeah, change the timer. Okay. Oh. We have another minute. Oh, look at that. <clears throat> Three minutes. No audio. Okay. I don't know if we need a whole three minutes, but now I think I'm back now. Okay, one minute. <clears throat> but anyway, it's that that lemmy part of the day where you cannot clear your throat for some reason. It might have something to do with whatever you ate, but uh, I have those moments. Do you have those moments, Daniel? No. <clears throat> <clears throat> Never? Maybe no, you I'm should having change one your now, and it's, and it's going to be all Maybe you should change your diet. Over. What? Give up my my cereal and my cupcakes and my potato chips? Yeah. I'd that was your die. lunch? <laughs> no. No, I had a banana. And, Wait, so, uh, so what happens, you know, we usually stream at noon, so do you eat an early lunch or a late lunch? <clears throat> I, my lunch is really just like a mid-afternoon snack, so whatever it happens to be. Okay, let's, let's talk about this right. some other time. Here we go. Hello, and welcome to a Flemmy Conversations with Curtis. <clears throat> he says as he's about to cough. How are you guys? Happy Friday. We did it. Three streams in one week. First time for me in a long time. It's great to be back. It's great to see you guys. Um, let me see who's here. Uh, what's up? Oh, lots of folks. 
lots of folks I don't know and a lot of folks I do. Tommy V8 is back, who, by the way, I will talk about him in just a second because he's one of our newest Patreon members. And then we got uh, lots of the gang. Zwex is here. Um Raccoon, Shot and Jaeger. Uh, who else? Who else? TF Ute. That's a new one. Nice. Thanks for joining. It is live stream daylight savings already. Uh, do what do is here. Ozzy, good to see you guys. Appreciate it. Um, so yeah, we're going to be playing some Under the Killing Moon and uh, back at it uh, after, when did we play it last? Monday, I think. So uh, after playing uh, Late Shift on Wednesday, and I want to talk to Daniel more about that when he comes out. So why don't we just get to that? Is there anything I have to say? Anything important? Any 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 sort of announcements to make? Can't think of anything. So let's thank our th Patreon members. Patreon members, thank you so much, including a brand new member, Tommy V85. Um, thank you so much. Uh, appreciate you joining us and being a part of this uh, family and keeping conversations with Curtis going. Uh, you also, I just want you to know, we also got your email today. You sent a, you know, some pictures of your your Phantasmagoria 2 uh, CD ROMs and uh, they're all, the, the CD ROMs are in German. And uh, I remember we've done that. We looked at that, those, those cases before. So at some point we will show your pictures on a future stream, but thanks for sending that in. And guys, if you are in a position like Tommy was to help us out and get, get us, uh, you know, continue our, our journey uh, through all things conversations with Curtis, then please consider joining us. We'd appreciate it. As always, thanks to our top donors, Malika Chandler, Francois Damagella, Moffat Reborn, Yuma81, Corbett Chu, and Alexander Sundin. Really appreciate you guys being our top donors on a monthly basis. If you can't join us on a monthly basis, but you want to join us on, you guys, I should have like a little, I feel like I'm, anyways, if you can, uh, you can help uh, get to our goal today. And our, our goal is, what is our goal? It's that number right up there. And uh, 100 bucks. If we can get to our goal of 100 bucks today, that would be awesome. And then if you are one of the top donors over a course of 30 days, we'll announce your name, which I'll do right now. Number one, at Comp you are. Number two, it's CJ. Number three, Jwex. Number four, Nolan. Number five, Ozzy Astroth. Number six, Joseph Austin. And number seven, IT Wander. Appreciate you guys. Um, all right, let's uh, let's bring Daniel out, and uh, I want to talk a little bit more about, about? late shift. <clears throat> Have you thought about it since we played it? Has it stayed with you? Yeah, it resonated with me a lot. I had dreams about it. That, ladies and gentlemen, is called sarcasm. <laughs> So here's someone mentioned in the earlier chat that they they likened it to uh, her story in terms of it's just movie scenes and you're making choices. Okay. We've got our first donation. What? From Doppelganger? Did he say anything? I can't hear. I don't, where's the widget? What's going on? Nothing works. Well, Nothing. probably broke. <laughs> Well, thank you, Doppelganger. Um, well, you got us to our fifty percent of our goal. That must have been a very kind donation. I we didn't. What is it? I should yeah, look it, up uh, it was a long message, so the text to speech didn't work. Looks like okay. you needed a pick me up after the last Under a Killing Moon episode. I've been catching up with the previous streams and really enjoyed the ones with Tori. Hope to see playthrough of the sequel, the Pandora Directive, in the near future. Keep up the good work, Murph. Hey, thank you, Murph. Appreciate that. That was very kind of you. Um, yeah, a couple things. Uh, Tori is always, I mean, we always are so thrilled when we can get her to join us. Uh, she's been a very busy person with her. I think he being, called uh, Murph Tex Murphy, not that his name is Murph. Uh, Keep up the good, work, good Murph. work, Murph. Oh, I guess we're we're Murph. Okay, so we're Murph. He's doppelganger. Um, yeah, well, anytime Tori can join us or wants to join us, she is always, always welcome. We just reached out to her. I just reached out to her the other day to see how she's doing. And she's saying that she'd like to, you know, she'd still like to keep doing these streams maybe once a month, maybe twice a month when she has the time. So we'll just keep, uh, we'll keep after her. It's always great to have her. Um, and then in terms of 
Yeah, I'm glad you're enjoying the previous streams and all that. Well, I don't know where we are with. Uh, let's finish this game first before we move on to another Tex Murphy game. We still like have a ways to go. But anyway, yeah. my response to the her story late shift comparison is that late shift doesn't allow you to piece information together. It doesn't allow you to, um, you know, there, there, what is happy. You're, you're not engaged in a sense that like you can actually figure something out. Her story, our job is to find out who she is and who the murderer is. And so we are detectives and being able to choose those movie scenes parcels out information in really interesting ways that allows you to be engaged and allows you to want to come back and allows you to want to get to the end where this was just a, you know, a kid gets stuck in a, it's very, you know, TV like storylines of a, you know, someone gets stuck in a bad situation. They're there. It's like suits, you know, he's a brilliant kid. He, he knows numbers and he can sort of, figure out his way and be a part of the gang. It just doesn't, there's nothing about it that I was never wondering. I never felt like the game involved me other than just making a quick decision. And that to me is the difference. Yeah. But that in the end is the limitation of, of FMV games. Nowadays, they rely too much on the cutscenes, And so there may be some variations like her story in which they build the plot around the fact that you, you're using a police computer to watch previous videos of her. But in the end, it's still just a bunch of scenes that in late shift, you watch in a linear story and you have a few branches or in her story, you just have just random videos that you can watch in whatever sequence you want to watch them in, but they're the same thing. I don't see them as different in any way. Well, I guess you're talking about the, the mechanics of it, right? You're, that's what you're, I mean, you're, but, but what I'm saying is that one is done in a very creative, very sort of a very creative way. And one is being done by the numbers. One has, one has yeah, a unique but, sort of feel know, to it. You, and the other one. you have her story and you have immortality, which both rely on the same thing that you can watch <laughs> random videos from various timelines or or various points in time and so it's still a limited oh, form I agree. Of I, i'm not i'm not arguing that i'm just saying that do better within those limitations use those limitations to the best of your ability as opposed to just telling a very standard cookie cutter story that doesn't engage you or make you it's it's kind of cool it's really well filmed acted and there's a lot of cool things about it but just not it just didn't feel very well realized on a creative point, you know, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that those, those be my thoughts. Those are the thoughts that I have on late shift. So we'll now put Here, that to the, bed. The, the, the TFI out says, I got the impression from late shift that it's gone kind of full circle now, as in it reminded me a lot of the old dragon layer interactive cartoon game from the eighties. And that's the thing because you know, when in the 90s, when they started creating FMV games, then classic point and click adventure game fans felt like it's a limited form of entertainment because while in the animated point and click games, you could explore everything and click on everything with FMV games, they had to limit it because they couldn't film every interaction. And so eventually we've reached a situation that the FMV games are so limited, they can be played on a TV, on Netflix. For example, people, people yeah. were, were truly amazed by the Black Mirror episode, but that's just TV catching up to the limited um, interactive uh, gameplay that you have nowadays in FMV games, not FMV games catching up to, I don't know, TV. Anyway, that's my anyway. Thing. All right. I don't think we're talking about the same kind of stuff, but I yeah, we're, getting, yeah, yeah. We're, yeah, we're talking about two separate things. But all right, so we're this is the time that we had bringing out our our guest for today and uh for whatever reason our guest for today has not uh is not here yet. <laughs> uh so we're going to uh you know, we know who you're 
we're here for today. And hopefully we'll get uh, a live in-person appearance. I hope everything's doing okay. Uh, but uh, I was just telling Daniel that I spaced on a, a Zoom meeting I was supposed to have with a, this company that I did some work for. Uh, and they wanted to do a follow-up. And I scheduled the Zoom meeting and I missed it. And they come, texted me saying, where are you? And you, that's a worse feeling when you're like, oh no, I knew I was supposed to do that, but I forgot. Um, so hopefully maybe that's something that's going on with uh, Noah, but he's not here right now, but uh, we just want to make you feel comfortable. So we're going to, we're going to bring our, the next best thing. This will be mm -hmm. our, our Spoonie, uh, our Spoonie doppelganger. There he is. What up? There he is. What's up Spoonie? Yeah. So uh, <laughs> we'll keep him with us in spirit. And if she, he comes and joins us for any of the game, we'll uh, we'll swap it's it out. And where's his name? I thought we were going to put a cool name, like a T. Let's put he'll be here soon, coming soon, right? Coming soon. Yeah, I'll edit afterwards. <laughs> afterwards? What do you mean afterwards? Uh, when After we the... when we're in the scene with the game, I'll edit. Okay. okay, that sounds good. Gotcha. I thought you meant like in post. You were going to edit it in after <laughs> we were done with this today. No post. Um, all right, so. Let's get to it. Let's go. Okay. Oh boy. I'm gonna read some chats here. Yeah, read some chats. I'll add the title in the meantime. Okay. Uh yeah, see. Okay, this is good. There's a conversation going on. Yeah, read the conversation. Uh, Late Shift became almost a dark comedy the way we played it, says I don't like Star Wars. Neither do I. Um, Chandler, Paul has standards. <laughs> I know. I know. Sorry about that, you guys. You're learning things about me. I, I have standards. Um, the Faustian Man. See, I dug Choose Your Own Adventure books. So to see something executed so well on Late Shift, well shot and acted for FMV was huge for me because no offense, FMV always was pretty poorly shot. And I totally agree with that. I think the way they filmed it is could not have been more professional, sleek, really cool filmmaking. I thought that was really quite impressive. But that, that to me, that was the best part of the whole game. Uh, Tommy writes, it's got so much fan service. It's so made for fans, just awesome. Um, not sure. Maybe you're talking about something else. Uh, Velvet Tea Cake writes, yes, the plot Paul got was definitely a Doom protagonist black comedy plot. Uh, Spoon yourself to review of some Laserdisc video games, I remember. Yeah, you guys are. Uh, okay. And Elizabeth Rose says, and yet when people play the more interactive games, they complain, why is that clickable? Why did they animate that whenever something clickable isn't relevant? That's true. That's true. I do that. Oh my gosh. You have Noah. And then you're going to change it to coming soon, right? No, no, no. It's, it's going to be Noah, and we're going to talk to him throughout the, the game. <laughs> no, but here's the thing. People are going to join us. What we want is to not have to stop throughout this thing and go, oh yeah, for all of you who just showed up, Noah's just not here yet. So that's why it, it, rather than Noah, just say not here yet or something. <laughs> and we can still talk to him, but that way we don't have to um, explain it. What's it no write? what? No what? Noah here not he here? <laughs> no what? No, no, that doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> coming soon yeah, coming soon that's better all right there we go now we're ready to go all right well i hope uh i hope uh noah comes i might i'll check our twitter in a little while but if not you're stuck with us or go find another stream that you were excited about uh sorry to have stolen your thunder um but we are going to continue on with our game today as because that's what we do we continue mm -hmm. on all right. Um, whoops. But this requires more of me having to interact with the game. When Noah's here, I let you guys do the heavy work. So sorry about that. All right, let's go. 
we got out of that room, right? Did we put so no, we're still in we the did, room. Oh, Jeez. We're still in the room. <laughs> Jesus. I had dreams about this part. Wait, no, what do we what's left that we have to do? We have to get the, some we have to play some oh, wait, the CD I, on the on wait, the cafeteria I need, I, I, thing. I need to make sure that I, I know where to hide. I'm supposed to hide yeah. over here. Okay. Right. Um but wow. what are we supposed to do, Daniel? We we need to go back in the television room and activate the TV, right? Yeah, maybe. We have the, the Buddha, the video cassette. The Buddha statue. So something I think No, crap. He's here. He's always here. Noah, are you getting dizzy too? He's getting dizzy, Daniel, because mm -hmm. he's speechless. He's without speech. Yeah. Okay, let's. We should be able to, to use this stuff, right? No, we have to. Oh, we need a key to get into the cabinet down there. The cabinet underneath the TV has something for us. Yeah, luckily, we have Noah to help us this time. Yeah. Well, the video screen works. Oh, oh we need what is this? Now I need what? The question is... Hmm. The Buddha statue, the video cassette, a match. Oh, what's that? <gasps> oh, come on. Look at that. Well, sorry, I was I was trying to text uh, our friend to see if he's on. Oh, where was that? Where was that? Here, I just I was. Wait here. a minute! Oh, come on! We didn't this we do so this stupid. though? No, because I remember at one point saying we should look around the door oh, cabinet yeah. key. This pixel hunting sucks. Wait, so you're on Twitter because I'm also on Twitter. Well, I just go on occasionally. He didn't respond, so we're good. Yeah. All right. Okay, uh, use the key on the, the cabinet there. It's so stupid, they, they even tell you it's the cabinet key. Use. Well, there we go, okay. good god. Okay, Turn now you put that. the tape in there. Though not an effective way to infect the mass population, <coughs> the viral powder combined with tobacco <coughs> then inhaled is the quickest way to provoke death. <coughs> Witness its effects on the traitor Paul Dubois. Paul Dubois. Oh, he's gonna. Oh. On a larger scale, the virus can be introduced into the upper atmosphere by means of dispenser satellites. With proper flight path alignment and a minimum of 100 dispensers, Earth's atmosphere could be thoroughly saturated within 12 hours. Once in the atmosphere, the viral molecules all kinds bond of weird to condensing tours, moisture and create a detours. seeding effect. The ensuing rainstorms would bring the virus down to the planet's surface. As we have witnessed, the effect of the virus is almost instantaneous, and the entire fauna population of the Earth should expire within several days at most. That sounds great! While this method of extermination is thorough, its residual effects are significant. The atmosphere will continue to cycle the virus for years until natural decay and filtering cause the viral strain to become a negligible portion of the atmosphere. We Oof. estimate that this process will require a minimum of 30 years to complete. Warning. This got very complicated. Security sweep. We'll go, go hide. Where do we hide in here? Five seconds. Hide! I can't while she's talking. I can't hide while she's talking. Oh, right. Where do we hide? Back here? That's right. Behind the desk. Good job. Duck. Um. Shh. Quiet. When I out look to the right and I see the three of us, and I for a minute, for a second, I actually think Noah's right there, and then I'm like, "Hey, say he's here!" Oh, it's not him. <laughs> hey, no, I'm going to see Dune tomorrow on an IMAX screen. Oh, yeah, I'm sure he's very happy about that. He's wanting to talk to somebody about it. All right. Uh, is that it? Wait, is that all we need to know? That Okay, so they are going to release, first of all, the person that they showed uh, as the victim of the gas 
he you just saw his face start to bubble but then you didn't see him die but then now they're going to put them in satellites and spray the earth and kill all of humanity yeah and they need to do it in 30 days 30 years 30 years how much of this are we going to need to know going forward i don't know what else we're supposed to do daniel what's the next thing because that was the last uh do I have to look at the hints without actually looking at the hints just to see what our main goals are? Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so assembling the note in the mesh, and we need that. Searching GRS. What's GRS? Okay. Is that GRS. where we're at right now? Yeah. And so we're avoiding in GRS, the GRS right? security eye. Okay, we know that. Getting into the wall safe in the supervisor's office. We got... You uh, we've got to it but we don't they, we got to get in there so yeah let's let's check that let's see what the next because we don't have the uh combination oh yeah we did get in it didn't we no go to the go GRS in. supervisor's room and look at the safe oh we haven't found the safe yet yes we did it was that thing that was the two things in the the click you were you were trying to brute force it but it didn't that was like that three streams ago we already opened oh, no. that one that was five uh, seven okay. one. All right, all right, all right. Let's go find a safe. Okay. Okay. Let's do this bad boy. Supervisor's office. Is he the supervisor? And oh, um, raccoon is saying, "Hey, thank you, thank God for him." Try to move. Uh, dude, that was fast. Um. Thank God for whom? He writes, you mentioned last time it might be a good idea to start examining the stuff you pick up. Okay, mm. so let's look at the Buddha statue. Let's take a look at this Buddha. Whoops, <sighs> so clumsy. Well, I'll be darned. This must be the winter chip. And it was right here under the cult's nose the whole time. The winter chip. All right, thanks, Um Raccoon. What else? When can we strike it? Decoded files. I think he was trying to get us to the winter chip. I don't think anything else is going to be. Now try the watch. How much do they really want us to read of that stuff? What's this? Aha! A secret compartment. Oh, can I can I use? Can I combine the winter chip? <sighs> really? Well, it's in the does it work differently now? That watch a secret compartment may be the safest place for me to hide the winter chip. Okay. That doesn't help us. Okay. It's See, if if uh if Spoonie were here. If the if Spoonie, if only Spoonie were here. If late shift had like a good narrator if, if the guy was narrating his actions and what what he was thinking while he was doing all those you know getting deeper into the the world of heist that might have that could have been fun they could have made yeah, it more yeah but he narrated the beginning of the oh, game yeah. had a narrator well it didn't it didn't really yeah hmm I mean, I love I love movies with narrating, but it the works best? on a, on a very specific the, type of movie. It doesn't the best work. one ever of all time? What is Goodfellas? That's the best narrated movie, I think. That just used that in a way that I'd never seen before. Just the way, the way he told the story. Oh, what are no, other good ones? Oh, Memento is another good one. I meant there's yeah. a good narrated mm -hmm. one. Yeah, but what are some other good movies that that are really good narration? Like the narration absolutely makes the film. I love Molly's times... Game. Molly's Game is a recent movie, and oh, has is that with uh, with uh, Jessica Chastain. Chastain and what Oscar Isaac, right? Mm, is he in that? I don't. Think, I don't remember. Is it good? Is Molly's Game good? Yeah, it's really good. Okay. And it's fast paced list. because Aaron Sorkin wrote it. So oh, I re yeah, really yeah. love Aaron Sor Sorkin's work. One of my favorite movies is The Social Network. It has a great soundtrack. It was written yeah. by Aaron Sorkin. 
I okay. remember really liking it when I saw it. I mean, I I, I was very. I haven't watched it since then. It has. I haven't been like inspired to go back to it, but I but I remember it, thinking it was really good. I think I watched it like seventy times. Run, Lola, run! Yeah, really? What? Yeah, yeah. How many? The seventy times. Seventy times. Yeah, I remember that there was there was a point in time where when I just watched it on a daily basis. It's like yeah. music. That that's the beauty of Aaron Sorkin's work. I mean, the the dialogue is like music. Can yeah, that's true. It's play really it in good. the background, and it's it, it's perfect. Yeah. Okay, so we haven't saved. Let's take a look at this Buddha. Was that a trash bin in the safe? I'm getting we're getting some. Uh... Did you go in the safe? I'm talking to you and not really paying attention to anything. No, you got to keep me on 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 point here. Where's the safe? So, let's see. Was it here? Tucker's office. Yeah. Okay, so is this the safe? Is the safe in the room with us? It's in here the somewhere. Panels probably do some he said, so the, the question was... Is this the safe room? Is this the trash bin? Oh. Oh. Shredded note. Shredded note. Oh, we got... Oh, oh man, I'm looking... We got to put it together, man. This game derailed so quickly. I mean, it started <laughs> off great. They, yeah. they even, it seemed like they were helping out more than games in the 90s used to. You got a hint system and you got the easy mode and you got saved games. But then we reach a situation where we're hiding from a giant eye. <clears throat> okay. Press and hold down the left mouse button, then slide the mouse to move the scrap. Oh, I'm wish. loving the narration in this game. I wish there was more of it. We just we've lost complete sight of anything. You know, I feel like Tex Murphy is just a non-character at this point. Uh, it, it's more fun feeling like I either need to see him more. Oh, this is going to be a nightmare. Really? So that that's the problem with. That's the problem with FMV games that have 3D navigation. Why don't you just have me clean my room? I mean, just, I'd rather put time into, you know, vacuuming the carpet than putting this thing together. Yeah. If I have to do something I don't like, it might as well. That's wow. the show for it. We're certain that this doesn't make for riveting live streaming yeah is there a way to just skip ahead okay let's can't even tell what the corners are or what the left side and the right side <laughs> not this one not this one not this one Read the chat from time to time because last time. <laughs> I am people... looking. Oh, sorry, I'll read about that. So uh, they're talking about stuff and other stuff. Uh, the safe is in that small room. Uh, you've won another shredded note puzzle. Oh no, another one of those. Whoop whoop. Shredded note assembly. Hooray. Uh, I used to watch Disney's Tron just about every day. Aha, uh -huh, someone, someone uh, identifying with your obsession with the uh, uh, film. Then Cry J says, "No, it's great." I think uh, Cry J is referring to it's fun watching you try to put a shredded puzzle together. So another show I like rewatching is Mr. Robot. Mr. Robot is also great. That one has been off for a while, right? But they had like five or six seasons, didn't they? They had four seasons. And, and one of the things that I, I'm really interested in finding out is whether or not Gen Z will make Lost 
popular again, given the fact that Lost is coming to Netflix in June. Yeah, they sure made Suits. I started watching Suits because of the, that those crazy Gen Z people. Like my son started watching it, and that's why I can. It's watchable. It's it's kind of fun. Oh, the end. I just heard. Did you receive the uh, comment? Um, this single oh. N far right side. All right, single you guys. N uh, far, oh, okay, you, I see it now. Okay, got it. Okay, so tell us more. Single yeah, N but, is right. Yeah, but single N there. can be the. No, Daniel. Can be, the the sink. Do you know where the single end is? Point the single end. This is the single end. No, no, no. Go to the right. Go right. No, let go. Go to the right. In the middle, there's just one blank sheet. This? Good. More to the left. Oh, They're right this? there. Oh, there's that's the right end. side. Right? No, he wants the whole that whole panel to be on the right side. Yes. Yeah, on the right side. Okay. Correct. But you should start by saying, thanks, Paul, for that. Uh, thanks for sharing that with me. Thanks, Spoonie. You were right. You do have something to offer to these streams. Um, the, the, and, and the interesting thing is that Gen Z made Friends popular again, but Gen Z didn't make Seinfeld popular again. And Seinfeld yeah. is still popular, but you don't hear anyone from Gen Z talking about it. We got tons of TikTok clips from Friends, yeah. but none from Seinfeld. Uh, the top ones, you know what? Okay. See the very top line. There's like a, yeah. what's clearly like yeah. going to be a, um, to whom yeah. it may concern or dear something. So let's, let's put those lines together first and see what that. Okay. Now join us. And I think the, the B, leave the conversation, the capital Paul. B? leave the conversation, Paul. What do you mean? No, I joined us. Oh, well, well, I'm leaving the conversation. I thought you were telling me to shut up. And that just was a weird way to tell me to shut up. Leave the conversation. Noah Antweiler. Well, well. Uh, I, I joined Come. on time. I joined the same time I always join. Oh, you're, you're Arizona. You're still. And we're, oh. we're, we're uh, our back. Arizona yeah. never changes. And we, last week, we, are live. we changed our, uh, we did daylight savings time. So oh, you changed. Oh God, I'm so we sorry. We changed. No, man, that's totally cool. I, I was just saying that. Um, that's fine. I I had exactly the same thing happen to me. Not not a, a time change thing, but I just spaced a meeting I was supposed to be in that I had kind of arranged. It was this big Zoom thing, and a bunch of people were going to be there, and then I didn't show up. And I get like a, an email. I'm on the in the car going, "We're all here. Where where are you?" And that was one of the most horrible moments of like oh no i screwed up so you're you're fine so just well, so you know not much we're live changed. you're still you're putting to yeah i see that uh i see you're putting together notes so not much has changed no yeah. man you missed um can you, you turn missed... your microphone a bit yeah hang on uh -huh. there we go how's that oh way better. welcome how's it going man how are you how are you? Doing your okay. I'm, time? I'm I'm embarrassed, but uh, otherwise I'm fine. Don't be. Don't we had be, we had the be. spoony uh, thumbnail ready. Take oh, a look. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so you were there. We were still talking to you. <laughs> yeah, you helped us out. <laughs> um, uh, how's uh how is your everything okay in the in the old dentist apartment things? Oh God, I have to get a bunch of teeth removed, but uh, yeah, yeah, otherwise I'm I'll be all right. These right. are useless. Yeah. Removed and then implanted. Um, well, last on Monday, you just missed us getting wandering around. There, we're we're being chased by a a bot, and we have to go into all these rooms and then hide from the bot as we're sort of picking things up. And so we're still there, but we just oh. got into. There yeah. we go. That looks like something. But I still think you should be doing the top. No, it's top not. Ones. It's not correct. What's not correct? It's not this one. It may be. It may say man, but yeah. the the top parts of the of this strip are incorrect. You see. Yeah, the, the, the top is line up. Yeah. But what I'm saying is that the top. If you look at the very top of the thing. Yeah, I know what you're saying. But well, then why don't we try to make that the first? You move all those to the left, and then we can okay. we can piece together what. 
So the problem oh, this is, puzzle is hellish. not those one, not the top one. That one goes away. Those go, not those two. Yeah, I know, I know. I just need to have some space to okay. work in. Gotcha. By the way, before the stream, I asked you, I told you that it cannot be daylight savings because they're both in the U.S. But now I understand that even people in the U.S. have not switched to daylight savings. Arizona and one other state, I think. Arizona doesn't do that. They opted out, which is like the coolest thing ever. I wish that the rest of the country would opt out. But yeah, Wait, they so, just, so they... now you're going to have to join like an hour early forever. Yeah, that's all right. So <laughs> until November. Oh, I guess so. Huh? Because it's not going to change. Yeah. See, there you go. Now those are looking, those are going to come together in some way. Let's get I've forgotten this puzzle existed. This is hellish. This is hellish. Burp. This makes no sense. Okay. We need a solution because otherwise we'll be here forever. Yeah, let's look it up if we can. Even if we look it up, to it's going to take you forever. Resume. Yeah, I don't really. Hint. Getting into the wall safe. Solve no. for us. <laughs> Where's the. What's the uh, question mark before? There's a question mark that we didn't get to. Assembling the note. Okay. Circumstance. No. Oh, man. The first lines of the note read Circumstance. No, that's the smoothly. previous one. Oh. Jeez, I hate them. Searching GRS. Well, might as well hit that question mark. Yeah, I'll hit it in a sec. Get into the wall safe. Wow. Well, yeah. These hints are pretty repetitive. Okay. So tell me what the the top line should say and click it from there. Uh, circumstances. Bro I thought you Brother said. Brother Marcus. Uh, Brother Marcus. Brother Marcus. Well, see, the, there's a... I, I, you can't see where I'm pointing. The, um... I know, I know. I, I wish I could have <laughs> access to a pointer so I could... Wait, I, I can see the, the Brother Marcus, so it's all, it's all good. Yeah, I was going to say, it's up there. I see it. There's That's the Marcus. You know what would help a little bit is some music. Let's get some music going. They didn't, didn't they give us, do we have right. to find our own music? Yeah. Shouldn't they be providing that? Yeah, before there right. was like some kind of like PI music, sax music. and. Did you turn the music off or something? No, I don't think so. There we go. <laughs> Top fuel tip to 11 pieces of eight should stand for get really stressed. <laughs> Thank you, Top Fuel. Appreciate that. Wow. What was that? Could should stand what? Yeah, I didn't understand it. I'm gonna look at it right now. I think I didn't hear our bot read it very well. GRS. That's it. GRS should stand for get really stressed. Oh, okay. Totally. Oh yeah, this feels like I'm on hold. <laughs> it does. It totally does. Your call is important to us. Please yeah. hold the line. Your uh, number is fifty-six. The waiting time is. Uh, Elizabeth just said seconds. there's also a listen. There's a strip that has a colon <laughs> at the top. That would be the end of the brother Marcus heading. So there should be a strip up at the top there that has a colon. Yeah, I see it. This one, okay. No, the other one. Yeah, this yeah, there one. It is. That, that one. So. Yeah, so Marcus. Yeah, but the thing is, you assemble these things, then I might have to move everything. I wish you could uh, group them together. I don't think together. so. I think you wasn't, there a, wasn't there a game where you could group them? Once, once you got them together, they just kind of clicked into place? Yeah, wasn't, wasn't there a like better this? game out there that we played? <laughs> Isn't like was it Seventh Seal or something where you? It would okay, there. I the see place. an. I see a. I see an F. If you look yes. along the the right side. Uh, the right yeah, there's one that the, starts right with there. F. There you go. We are oh. seekers of. Yeah. Okay. Our brother. T. 
TH brother, TH and uh, for our order and oh boy, someone else help. <laughs> you, I actually okay, did something. This, travel with you. Let's look for you in this line. <laughs> Weird just wrote, I think this puzzle is going to be a pain in Daniel's colon. I think <laughs> it already is. In my semicolon. <laughs> Your semicolon. Where's the... This one? This? There it is. Yeah. That, looks right. that looks good. We are okay. seekers of... Brother th pay pay out me pay out tommy underscore v85 poured five dollars into the cwc tip jar we interrupt this exciting puzzle with the following message it would so rock if you could cue the jeopardy thinking music to this puzzle <laughs> we would we would but we would get uh we thank you for your donation tommy but we would get tagged with the copyright stuff yeah. in fact we got tagged just playing uh yeah, that stupid game. Uh, late shift yesterday, they used all kinds of. They also spent a ton of money uh, being able to copyright, use copyrighted music, which means we can't, you know, get anything from our stream. We, we played late shift yesterday. Noah, have you heard of that game? Yeah. It, is it, that an FMB game? Yeah. More it like is. crap shift. It was pretty bad it's it's unbelievably uh well filmed it's like a movie it's really high end it, it looks it looks super slick and um but the gameplay and all you're doing is just go this way or go that way the, daniel's doing good see the, the more we the more we uh ignore him you sound surprised <laughs> no that, I'm, that I'm, you're I'm doing not surprised I'm right. surprised. Thanks, Tom. Let's go to T O T. There's there's two of those. I see go. I see one. Uh, to oh jeez. Um, no, it's supposed to be T O. Go it's to. It's the fourth one this. from the right there. No, the other one to the left. The one next to it. This one. The next that one. Yeah. Right? yeah. Go to, right. Go to. Awesome. Time is. Got... You have to had to eliminate maybe eliminate, elim, ma. Yeah. Elim nice. Nate in. You see an in? No. Eliminate. There's one. You, you... This one? No. There you go. That. Uh, elim... S. Maybe it's not eliminate. I'm not sure. Wait. E -L -I wait, 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 this is messed up. Yeah, wait. that's not right. Oh, it is right. Or it isn't. Wait I can't move all of the things I've... I've placed Oh, they directly. do lock into place. So they lock yeah. into place. So you can move everything one big glob to the left a little bit. Well, wait. Crap. Now nothing works. They're not locked into place. The game's stuck. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I was proud of the game. Like, way to go, game. Jeez, no! You have to oh, no. reboot. <laughs> you have to reboot. Oh no! You didn't save either, so it's gonna all. Oh, be... oh, oh no! Oh, oh it's, oh, back. it's back! It's back! It's back! It's back! Okay. We're back. So that one's not right. That one needs. That one yeah. doesn't seem right. Uh, it's 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 um that S word is is the folly of man, comma Shanzi. It's a it's an E at the end. Oh E. The one to the direct left of the big glob has an E. Yeah, I think that's I think that's the right the one to the just to the left. left of the big one. Just to the left. Other, this one? other left, this one? other left. left. No, nope, other left. This one? Oh no, go on the Way other side. The left. The, yeah. the, no, not that okay. one, not that one. It's the one closest to the big one. Okay, gotcha. That one. Yes. Yay. Okay. okay. With you to the moon. Probably moon child. Moon. See, I, yeah, no, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Eliminate. Yeah. That looks really good. This oh, the one child. to the yeah. left of yeah. the. Nope. This oh, one. There you go. Oh, okay. Yeah. Moon child. Moon child. 
Dang, you're kicking butt. It gets faster the further we go in there, yeah. Yeah, good job. Before, before, where's the E? Before the this? E. No. Before this? No. Before. It's supposed to be before. It can be anything else. I think you have two close together. You should move those two right there to it. Yeah, there's That's before. It. There you go. Man, this music is better than the one in the game. Uh, that says go to the bastion. Go so... to the bathroom. Go to the... No, it's not uh, this one. Go to the... Oh, oh, you know, there's an end. The second to the right. Second to the right. Oh, that one right there. This one? That's the one. Yeah. Yeah. That's the one. Show... Attend just, before joining just, ING just, and no, then the cheese. Just, just and yeah, thought. That one right there. No, to the closest Oh, I really to the hope we one. don't have to move this whole note to the left. Closest <laughs> to the big one, that to the right. That, no, no, no. Other side. The, that one. No, sorry. The, Look at the. There it is. That one. Yeah, that right there. No. Yeah, it is. No, this I don't one? think so. No, I no. don't. Thought. Go. Show me, show me that one one more time, because I didn't see what you didn't. See. This one. Oh, you might be right. Okay. No, no. There it is. No. G H O U G H. Yeah, I think that's no. it. Okay. Yeah. Jeez, Daniel. Now. Jeffrey just gave us a new donation. Was did he? Did he? His go on too long? Did it? Take a look here. Probably where's, this where, one. where's the widget? Oh, okay. Well, um, yeah, it is a little bit long. So our our voice widgets. Oh, we did it. Jeffrey, I'm gonna read your comment in just a second, but hold on. Daniel, you deserve this one. Read it out loud, brother. Brother Daniel. The entire thing? Okay. Heck yeah. Oh. Brother Marcus, we are seekers of purity who will abide no defect in spirit or form. The time is close to close at hand. Your work was exemplary and adhered in every detail to the holy prophecies. Super. Now that we have the sacred relic in our possession, our plans can be carried out. I regret that you had to eliminate Dubois. Oh, okay. Alas, such is the folly of man. Shanzi is being held on the moon child and will pay dearly for her treachery. Also, as feared, brother Thaniel was not genetically suitable for our order and had to be retired. Now your instructions. Go to the Bastion of Sanctity. Upon arriving, the Chameleon will provide transport, though he will not travel with you to the Moonchild just now, as he has other business to attend to before joining us. Godspeed, brother. I can't believe there's a moon... I can't believe there's a moon base in this game. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Alright, I'm going to read uh, Jeffrey's comment he wrote paul and daniel big fan of the channel spoonie i have been a fan of yours for years i can't believe in your last stream that when paul asked if anyone could identify the bird that no one mentioned you are a well-known bird watching fvhs board game expert love you guys is this true um i reviewed a long time ago a vhs board game a game with a vhs tape in it that that very rarely was ever made. The old called, kind uh, of FMV games. Yeah, very old. Uh, it's called Gone Birding, which is basically just a bird identification game. Uh, very dry, very academic, uh, very educational. Um, <laughs> so but not much of value. a game, really. <laughs> I, actually, I did see the value in it. Um, it's just not much of a game. It's just, right. it's just bird after bird after bird. And once you've played it once, you pretty much know the entire run of the game. So gotcha. Well, thank you, Jeffrey. Appreciate Wait, that. We'll stop the music. Oh, okay. Um. So when can we get out of this building? Was okay. it worse than VHS Golf? No. Uh, it was a better made game than VHS Golf. <laughs> there, there was a Star Trek that... one, right? Oh yeah. I didn't review that one though. Okay, okay, what do we got to do now? I was just save, save? Yeah, I saved. Yeah, save. Save for the save. Oh, yeah, thank God. 
Hint. There's a wall safe we have to get into. Yeah, but they keep telling us go to the GRS supervisor's office and look at the safe. We've been okay. through. To, so to we're every in room. Tucker's office. I guess we have to go in. Are we in the wrong room? Who's the GRS supervisor? ZJ West That's... tipped 10 pieces 08. Spoonie also talked about the laser disc game Mystery Disc. Murder anyone? Super interesting. Yeah, that was a that was a game that was on Laserdisc. I don't remember. I don't know if you remember that format of movies where they came on gigantic CDs. We talked about it in our last stream. Oh yeah, you did. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's okay. Keep going. I want to hear. Yeah. Uh, it was a it was another full motion video, like an interactive movie type thing, where uh, it was about uh, it was like a whodunit. You know, uh, somebody gets murdered at their mansion, mm -hmm. and you got to figure out who did it. And it's uh, that one actually is very well made. I like that one a lot. Um, I tried to live stream it a while ago, but it didn't work out. It was kind of it's not easy to hook up a laser disc player to this sort of thing. So the thing we talked about in our last stream is whether or not we had uh, a laser disc, because both Paul and I switched from from VHS directly to DVD. Did yeah, you enjoy that format? Because I know that the, the audio is uncompressed, and so the audio should be better on paper than DVD, uh, which has compressed audio, but it's super noisy and got only 30 minutes per side. That's more than 30 minutes. Uh, I know that, because we used to watch... Uh, I used to watch Star Wars all the time on Laserdisc, and so it was like... It's, it's like 50, 55 minutes per side. Um, I know for a long time that was the best version of Star Wars that you could get was the one on Laserdisc because yep. it was the closest to digital that you could find. So yeah, I used to watch it all the time on Laserdisc. It was still, it's still the best version because it's not the special edition. Correct. <laughs> one guy plays right. Uh, only person I know who had a Laserdisc back in the day was my great grandmother. Uh huh. Uh huh. Way to make me feel um, old. Fungy. Exactly. <laughs> uh, and by the way, I just want to say thank you, Juex. Uh, they started answering your question right away, but I want to thank you for your your support and is this the safe? support. Where is the safe? Appreciate it, man. Yeah, a long time ago, YouTube used to do this thing where you could you could um, create buttons on the video to mm -hmm. like navigate between videos. And I I tried to put the mystery disc thing on YouTube. Don't as go a yet, Daniel. Hold on a second. A, oh, I want to hear this. Hold on just a second. There. I want to let someone help us where, figure out where the safe oh, is. We, I'm tired of... Tex Murphy tipped $30. Decking. Hope you'll find some more torn papers. Those puzzles <laughs> are the best. <laughs> Screw you, Tex. I love it. <laughs> Thank you, Tex. Appreciate How many that. does that make so far? Three? Uh, we three, three what? Safe? Oh, torn yeah. Puzzles. Maybe. I think three or four yeah oh but, my god yeah someone tell us where the safe is and sorry i didn't mean to interrupt uh, no but i didn't want daniel to go back out and run away from the robot again until we no, let's so find it's the this safe. one You're right. it's over here this is the supervisor's room i have no clue oh baby. i can i can look up a guide yeah maybe So DHJR mentioned that these specialized editions, and they're great, but I, again, we'd prefer it if Lucasfilm would release it. Okay, so it doesn't look like there's anything in here, but there's maybe some secret little thing, and when someone yeah, tells but... us what it is, we're going to go... Okay, so we're gonna get all that. GRS supervisor's office slash Ava's office. Warning. Okay, so it... security sweep Ooh. will begin in five seconds. Is it, are we in where the right can I Where can I hide here? Over here? Uh, I don't under a desk. Under, behind this, behind over, the uh, plant. Over here? Behind the plant. Over here? No, over here. Over it's here. behind the plant. No, it gives you you no, it's not yeah. over here. It's behind the plant, remember? Yeah. Okay. So we're here, we got the assembled thingy. Okay, so this is the room. Hide behind the plants. All the guide says is look at the safe in the wall. Uh, have look you seen any six-digit codes lately? 
It's, it's this room. Yeah. It says Ava's office. Is this Ava's office? No. No. Well, is she the supervisor? Because uh, this is. Yes. They, are they sharing? Because the someone, someone said in the chat that it's Marcus Tucker's room. No, no that's no. not it. So it's supposed to be Ava's room? Yeah. I think so. Is she the supervisor? Maybe so. Not this but, one. But, you know, she's not much of a supervisor if she has to share her room with three other people. But they're all project supervisors. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so, so this is Ava's thingy. Okay. So it's, uh, we, where's the safe? Is this the is safe? Is the safe? Is the safe in the room with wow, us? Wow, they had computer console. All the guide says is look at the safe in the wall. But which room? Oh, there it is right there, right in front of you. Right there. Right in front of you, that, right now. That's not a safe. This? This type is no. <laughs> This type is <laughs> <laughs> What's it like being totally wrong in the middle of your sentence? What is it like <laughs> being, you're like, that is totally, oh, right there. I don't know. You oh, tell me. Gosh. Yeah, I don't, that, I'm used to it. It's probably. Okay, it says, remember the note in Marcus Tucker's desk? Use the safe and enter the code 142235. Was that the longitude, lang that longitude, longitude numbers that Wait, we? Did how we would we open the safe already? You, one nope. four two two three five. Oh, one four three, two five. two because you said one three, four two two five three five one two. Oh, wait, let's oh, stop for a second. One four, one, four two two three five. Okay, stop for a second. So if. Noah didn't tell us that this combination because he has saw it on the cheat sheet. How would we have figured it out? It was in a note on in someone's desk. I think you've already found it. Okay. And well, there we go. What is that? Microfilm? Viral powder. powder. Oh, that's the powder that kills. Gonna... They're trying to destroy humanity, Noah. They're, uh, uh -huh. They have a viral power powder that when inhaled, it will kill you instantly. And they're going to put it in satellites all over the world and then drop it on us. And we're all going to... Humanity will, will no longer be in existence in 30 years. Warning. Security sweep. We'll Crap! This is the moment I saved. Five seconds. You you did a different save file though, so you're okay. No, I used the same one. Oh. I was too cocky. Uh. Oh <laughs> okay, let's. I think you can leave now. Leave the oh, compound. Oh, yeah, God, I think you can leave great. totally. Okay. I'm I'm ready for I'm ready to leave this. I want to go back to our office and look at the fax machine. I want to talk I think to the that's guy what in you the dumpster. Do, yeah. Oh, you have to put the note back together. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. He doesn't have to do. That. Do we have that safe? Did you already let's, save let's after the safe? Try to move a little. Ah. What the? Can't you just click travel? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, where were you on on Monday, man? How many, how many times he's just? No, but on Monday we we didn't need to travel, so it wouldn't have helped us back then. Couldn't you have just traveled from office sure, to office to that way GRS. without having to run right away no, from No, the, the travel is. Are you sure? Before I go yeah. anywhere else, first thing in the morning. I'll need to go back and check on Elena. Okay, I guess it's first thing in the morning. Uh, nice people effect. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not him. There's been a change in plans. You and I have a date with destiny. Let's go. Destiny doesn't it like to like wait. I've been Let's go. For about ten seconds when I hear something moving through the office. What the? What I thought he was Native American. I didn't know he was Cuban. 
<laughs> you heard it here first. The ability to change form. The the, the joke Noah said that made him laugh so much. He had an answer. But I found it quite useful. <laughs> what is going on here? A chance to thank you for your efforts to our cause. You did us a great favor in retrieving the statuette. It was the last key to fulfilling our ancient prophecies. Now we Boing. wait until the appointed time. Incidentally, I've kidnapped your girlfriend. Oh, by the way. I know you're looking for a certain computer chip. Wait, the girlfriend? The girl at the, the newsstand? And I won't harm Miss Moore. Yeah. It would be a shame to kill her. Besides... It's not easy stuffing a head into one of those water coolers. Oh, I missed that. Just ask your oh. Pug. He's cooling off right now. We oh, I didn't miss it. Stuffing a head in a water cooler. Hey, it's hey, from Phantasmagoria. It's from Phantasmagoria. Nice game, you guys. That was good. How, oh, how man. did you do that? I'm impressed. We got through that whole... Oh, wait a minute. Ow. Oh, that's another day. Keep the odds. I'm not sure the odds of us ever finishing this are very good. A chameleon to one. I mean, we're on stream six. I tried for six. an hour to get Pug's head out of the water cooler, but it was no dice. <laughs> Police showed up and thought about grilling me until they realized Pug was a mutant. And it was like they couldn't care less. <laughs> That's the trouble with this world. A life's still a life, whether it's mine or pugs, it still has to count for something. If a crime to humanity is committed, someone should have to pay for it. The chameleon had killed Pug for no good reason and had kidnapped Elena. I'm not about to let him get away with it. Not Heck today. not. You're Tex Murphy. Now this is good, Def. This is now we're back. Now the game's finding its footing again. When Murphy's trying to get a decapitated head out of a water cooler bottle, that's good stuff. Okay, let's check the facts. Let's check the facts first. My shiny but cheaply made fax machine. Yeah. Wait, check the this. computer. It's the computer, right? Yeah. Anything new? Prime Link. No, we know this right now. Okay. What now? Nothing on the floor. Uh, it says just to go to the Bastion of Sanctity, but uh, I'll stop reading the guide now. I don't want to spoil okay. it. Okay. Is that new? Boop. Yeah. Okay. It does say, as soon as you arrive, safe, because as soon as the chameleon sees you, he kills you. I heard that some rich guy a few years back bought the remaining pieces of an ancient European castle. This must be the place. As I approach the coordinates given in the shredded note from GRS, I see a massive structure jutting out from a deeply forested area. The bastion looks like a medieval castle, but there's nothing romantic about this place. It seems to lay there, a festering evil. Like a paper cut gone bad. From here, I can get a good look at the chameleon. He's pacing around, smoking like a brush fire and talking to himself. I don't know what he's smoking, but he looks higher than an infield fly. I've got to distract him somehow and get him out of the room. Then I'll figure out a way to get him out of here for good. Save, 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 save. save. So he's, he looks like he's standing next to somebody. Yeah, that's the girlfriend he kidnapped her. Okay. Elena, Elena, I think. Okay. So now, see if you can not get killed right away. See what you can do. No, it's just a chair. It's not a person. It's a person. Actually, do, next get, to a do chair. get killed. I want to hear. I want to hear James Earl Jones. Yeah. I. Yep. In case you've forgotten, the fourth rule of a PI is don't get caught. Maybe nice. you should get the chameleon to leave the main oh, hall yeah. before you stroll in. Don't think of it. James Earl Jones has tons of lines in this game. Fantastic. And okay, so 
Yes, Elvin D. Frank, that is James Earl Jones, Darth Vader himself. They got Man him. For failed this game. me for the last time. Okay. So go down a different room. Always Gently, go left. Quietly, quietly. Is that true? Yeah, always go left. Always go left. What's the, what's the story behind that? What? Well, why? How I don't do you... know. I always just, I always just go left. <laughs> <laughs> That's just your own rule to yourself. Or have you found yeah. that to be regularly helpful? Well, I'll be darned. Yeah, it's, it's helpful all the time. I, I I find left is usually the correct way to go. Okay, I've got a bunchy cord. What, what were those two dudes? Why do you go by the two dudes? What do you want me to do with him? I don't want well, to look at him. Look at him. Put, examine them. What's in there? He's 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 on a he's racing. Hey, yeah, you're going too nice. fast, man. I bet Rook wouldn't mind capturing these. There's a bunch of weapons. Can you grab any of the weapons? Really yeah, attack the chameleon with a sword. Wait, wait. He said. I want to hear what he said. Hey, would be wait. Really there's something here. Well, this is your standard lamp. lamp. Okay. These weapons would be really useful if someone hadn't bolted them to the bolted wall. Bolted them to the wall. Okay, so they're not going to be useful. Now I'm intrigued. I wonder what the world record is for speedrunning this game. Because with so many shredded note puzzles, I doubt that you can oh, finish the true. game. Oh, that's true. Do you think true. there are, are speedruns of this game? Yeah. Is there anything in the... Is is there anything There's... in that gargoyle face? There's got to be something to that. Maybe we need to play something. Well, I'll be darned. That's Uncle Morty, and he was not a handsome... Is there something in the eyeball? Yes. Yeah. Nice job, Noah. The gemstone. gemstone. Okay. Okay, now go run as fast run. as you can. Go, Run go forward. We got Straight everything ahead. we needed. No, there's stuff on the other side, though. Yeah, go. but we've been through the other side. Here is the other side. We've just oh, been yeah. there. Oh, okay. I didn't realize. Okay. So we've been through the whole... Okay, we have to distract him. Right yeah, we have to distract him. So we're going to throw the gemstone somewhere. We're going to... Oh, what What's that? Let's save. Is that the room he's in? To the right? Okay. Um, look at your inventory. Clamp. It's stone small, but it's very dense and heavy. You could throw it at him. What's the clamp? Check that out. The bungee cord. DFY out says that 28 minutes is the world record for finishing this game. This gemstone. No uh, kidding. Yeah. Okay, bungee cord. So we need to attach the clamp to the bungee cord, and then he's going to go after something. Can you combine those three, the gemstone onto the bungee cord? Yep. No, I, I use the, the bungee cord and the clamp. Yeah. And this with this. There we go. That's what I was talking about. Oh. So now. I got a gonna... slingshot. Yeah, there you go. Use. Well, that's not gonna work. Maybe yes, I need it to... is. Well, that's not gonna work. Well, that's not gonna work. What do I need to hit? Off to the side somewhere. It's like a different, like a different room. Maybe I need Wait, to hit please. some. Maybe I need to hit. Do we have a? Oh, the the is there like a a shield? Well, hit the shield. Work. The shield might make a big noise. Shield. And where the shield where all those um where all the have you examined are. um go back to your inventory again. Have you examined the cigarette case? Yes, we have a we have a uh, thing in there. Oh left no the case. Have... Maybe I'll keep it around for a smoking emergency. Okay, so he th he threw the case and now we have a cigarette. Okay. Because I know how you kill this well, guy, but I was like you don't have the well, thing that you need. Work. You need the cigarette. Well, that's not. Now I know. Well, that's not. 
Well, that's not going to work. So I was going to say, Daniel, go back to where the um, go back to where the weapons are. I'm probably wrong, but I want to try something. Well, that's not going to work. Okay. What do you want me to try out? Go back go to, to the... where the weapons are, right here. Okay. And then, oh, there's not. Eh, never mind. I was thinking like one of those swords you could do the slingshot, but it's not. That doesn't look like it's. Yeah. So hitting the chandelier doesn't work either. Combine the powder with. Oh, that thing. What's that? What's that thing on the wall right there? Really? What made you decide to do? Oh, somebody say that in there. Yeah. Comments. Okay. And then I there's a match. Figure that one out. There's the match. Cigarette. Do you want to put the match on the on that well, thing? A... Oh, the vase. Oh, I'll oh, I'll oh. oh, that's right. The vase. There it is. Yeah. For all the good that did. Uh, that might have distracted him. It that distracted might've... him. Go for it. Oh, they are spider on it. Yeah, not there. Okay, go Pick to the ashtray and up. use the yeah. li light the match. No, goodbye. Match. Cigarette. Yes. Oh boy, oh boy. Can time we do, do it? we have? No, use. Just throw it on the ground. This is sick, Tex. Okay, the cigarette's in place. Now if you'll just go for it. Yeah, here he comes. Come on. Come on, come, come, come on. on. Over to the table for some real smoking enjoyment. He's got it. He's got it. That's it. Smoke away, sucker. Gotcha. Wait, why don't they show it? Oh, there he goes. Why do they have to say uh, everything? I'm in flavor country. <laughs> <laughs> That's our, first, that's our first real recorded death, and they always sort of cut away before. Didn't anyone ever tell you these things can kill you? Yeah. Oh, oh. That was up. It's chilling. He's I like, come on over here, big guy. Viral powder in my cigarette. Very clever. You're a worthy opponent. You know, I think the world would be a much nicer place without people like you. People who go around stuffing other people's heads into water coolers. But that you've me. accomplished nothing. <clears throat> Except now, I'll be a martyr in the new order. And you'll die with all the other vermin in the great... Luvia. And when the earth has returned to a state of perfection. <laughs> that, that's how looping. you get three hours of, of footage. <laughs> by I think they slowly. looped in the his panting. His panting is like on a loop. It's not... My name will live forever. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's good in theory. Too bad you won't be around to enjoy it. Oh, yeah. Curse you, Tex Murphy. Death means nothing. I would I mean, this is very true to the death scenes from the 80s and 90s, in which the, the antagonist would die for Super hours prophecy. on screen. Enjoy your victory while you can, Murphy. Tomorrow night. I don't know, it doesn't seem like you lethal powder to me. Uh. Oh, this is a big special effects moment for these guys. That took some time. I caught a lucky break getting rid of the chameleon this easy. How many hours do you think somebody worked on that particular thing? He did. Uh, Photoshop morphing. I've got to get Elena yeah. out of the force field. Can we look at some of these? Let's go look at some of these, uh, these statues. Mm, bread, milk, we got some time to look around. Sauce. Damn. I know I'm forgetting something. So the... Oh, 
fun fact about the the morphing effect. I want to hear what he says about the things. Let him. You're just zipping along. Can't you read? Oh, poor guy. That's a pretty small leaf. Mm -hmm. This is Peter loaning Paul his Sergeant Pepper's album. Peter loaning Paul. Get it? Yeah. yeah. Chameleon has Beatles a reference in the post-apocalypse. <laughs> Not many people get it, but keeping her sedated. With a chameleon out of the way, I can find the right people get it. it oh, wait, we can save her by let's shutting off the, the force let's field. At, well, let's look at the art first. There's more art to look at. Okay, they didn't even bother creating 3D flames. This is a video playing inside the fireplace. A video of a fireplace. We have a. I put a TV in our fireplace for the winter, and we just run the Netflix fireplace on that, and it's surprisingly relax, relaxing, and, and comforting. And we don't have to deal with the, all the ashes. Yeah, when you have a working yeah, chimney, you have to clean the flue and the stuff like that. It's a real hassle. Yeah. And we can't afford the electric fireplace. Those things are expensive, man. Yeah, they are. We'll get one someday. Renaissance couple returning an overdue library book. All right, we got a little quip for each piece of art. There you go. What, what's the, well, let's see what he's going to say. Let's take a look at it and then try to come About up what? with what? About the shield? The, the, go, go to the red one. Move. Oh, nice. I want to look at the red piece of art. Don't turn it on yet. Don't enjoyed. do it. Okay. This one? Let's go to the red piece of art. Yeah. I want to look at it and then know what Looking do you think he's going to say? Something? Uh, uh, Daniel. Not that. <laughs> Daniel, you're, not, you're just the worst listener of all time <laughs> when you're playing a game and not when you're focused on your game. I had a whole thing and you, okay. you weren't even listening. I was going to say, it looks like Jesus hailing a cab. but uh, that's See, just... that's really good. But now, now what did he say? Looking at this painting reminds me of the time that girl told me I had Roman hands. Okay, uh, Chad. Or, or hitch you. hitchhiking, rather, not 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 a cab. I screwed up my own riff. <laughs> oh, what's your what's your riff? So that you can you can. Uh, it looks like he's hitchhiking. Okay, hitchhiking to the crucifixion. So, uh, yeah. Chad, which one did you like better? Uh, the what was the one he said? I like yours better now. Getting an Thank Uber you. to the crucifixion. Tess, oh, you you were able to. You'd come. That that monster came to the motel. He looked just like. Why you. is she? I thought, so I the what did that turning on do? Turn off the force field. Oh, yeah. okay. Oh, Tex, hold me. Kiss me. Ding, ding. Okay. Halitosis humor. There's Gum no way to say yes. All we, have to, we have to refuse no matter what. That sucks. Yeah. Gumshoe okay. motto. Choose what? Gumshoe motto. Oh, gumshoe motto, yeah. Sorry, Elena. But like I was told long ago, guns don't kill detectives. Love does. Nice. Besides, every time I look at you, I can't help but think of your sister, and that gives me a stomach ache. You didn't have Tex, to overdo it. I, I think I'm in love with you. Ding. Worried about genetics. <laughs> well, that's nice of you to say, but I'm pretty sure you got your family's genes, and it just wouldn't work out. Are you sure there's nothing I can do to make you stay? Ding. Hmm. Do you play twisty? Ah, eh, never mind. Choose what? Pi pious excuse. I guess I should have told you about my, well, my vow of chastity. But right now, I got a job to do, and I've got to do it alone. Unless I stop the cult from executing their plan, we're all going to be toast. Men worth having are always running off. Maybe it wouldn't work out for us anyway. If they don't kill you, let me buy you a drink. I owe you a big one. Ding. Soda jerk. Okay. Well, maybe someday you can buy me one of those 46 ounce super gulpers. What I really need right now is a good lead. The chameleon oh, said shit. that he was supposed to meet up with someone named. Hey, they haven't Carol filmed that scene. That's why we're not seeing it. Skull. But Where's your fidgeter? You Where's your fidgeting, Chris Jones? Yeah, it does, as a matter of fact. He summoned to his presence a thousand Ooh. hale and light-hearted friends. 
to the deep seclusion of one of his castellated abbeys. Thank you, this Darth. was an extensive and magnificent structure, the creation of the prince's own eccentric yet august taste. A strong and lofty wall girdled it in. Without was the Red Death. That's such a great voice, my god. Is that the final group? Yes, brother. Everyone has arrived. And all the provisions are stored. What about the wine? This is the outtakes of the early It Was a Wonderful Life opening. Order, we have We've got to help to George Bailey. To <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> totally. I master that everything is prepared. Is that him down there, sir? The celebration is set to begin at the appointed hour. Colonel's Bro, office? Is that new? Off planet. Motel. We can leave the planet? Cool. The broken skull off planet is new. Should we go there? Yeah. Oh, oh okay. Up to the left. All right. Yeah. Have we been to the roadside motel? Yeah. Right. Does our car, our car just goes into space. Nice. Yeah. This is just like Fast and the Furious. The way station is small with a diameter of maybe 5,000 meters. I have no problem finding the Broken Skull, which turns out to be a typical off-world saloon. The kind of place typical. where all the booze is typical. watered down, the prices are triple, and the waitresses all have fresh stitches on their foreheads. It's strangely quiet, though, and the dame behind the bar looks like she'd just as soon cut my throat as pour me a drink. So what do you have? Wait a minute, is that Marco Kidder? We gotta save the game. I believe, uh, I think so. <laughs> Is that Margo Kidder? Are you kidding? They got Karen Allen in one. They got Margo Kidder in another. Okay. Because I believe she right. can kill us. How long does it take before she comes on to him? Let's see. Where, when does the bell come out? Let's order a man. No, to make a pass. Give I want to get the thing. Four fingers of rye whiskey. Neat. Four fingers. You know, we don't take American Express. Cash customers only. Okay. No, you choose, Daniel. Do do. I think we need some good credit card humor. Thought the place looked familiar. I must have seen it in a Visa commercial. Boom. Ah, very amusing. What brought you here? My car. I used, to, I used to be Lois Lane. Did you, you recognize me? Looking for some friends of mine who came here a while ago. A lot of people come and go here. I, think I bet you'd do a lot for a hundred bucks. How about answering a few questions? Put your money where your mouth is, Rockefeller. Do we have a hundred bucks? We do. Oh, there we go. Where'd that come from? <laughs> How convenient. I don't know. I know we had a thousand dollars from the Countess. One question. Okay, one question. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, um, okay, okay. Bluffing name dropper. Interested in transportation info on the folks from GRS, probably GRS, right? What's the bluffing name dropper? Uh, I, don't I, don't, I don't know. Let's do C. What do you know about Ava Shanzi, Paul Dubois, and Camden Leander? There's your name dropping. They were here about a month ago. I don't know where they went. There's your answer. Now I'm going to have Bluto escort you out. We don't need nosy types around here. <laughs> hey, Bluto! I shouldn't have to remind you, Murphy. What? Never underestimate a woman with an attitude. What? We're dead? She... I guess that was the end of our investigation. We couldn't get any further. So what do you have? Oh. I'm going to make a pass. I want to see if she... let, let Paul so have his. What do you got there, <laughs> sweetheart? Call me sweetheart again, and I'll tear your throat out. Paul's All been right, with the game, so he knows nice. what to do. She's not going to come on to him. This is a, this is the first time in his life that a woman hasn't. You choose one. Uh, pouty, pouty apology. Jeez, <laughs> I'm sorry. Now I know why they call the place the Broken Skull. Even the friendlies are unfriendly. Mind your manners, and I won't introduce you to Bluto. He's the reason why we call this the Broken Skull. Well, so one more chance. Have? Oh, wow, okay, we didn't die. I guess you have to order a manly drink. Don't do it again. <laughs> we, Four we, fingers yeah. of rye whiskey. Oh, we did that already. Sorry, we have to do the other one. You know, we don't take... 
Look at cash humor. Casual bribe. Put your money where your mouth is, Rockefeller. Okay, so I guess bucks. we'll die either way. I think we no, got hundred bucks. Okay, choose transportation. Yeah, that's the only Can one you that's help not. Help me find to... a ride to the moon, child. Do you have the token? Ooh. Do we have a token? Uh, not yet. We're gonna go look around and we'll come back. Unprepared. Uh, inquisitive, inquisitive, because then we'll find out what Maybe. the token's all about. Give me a hint on the type of token you're looking for. Wrong nope. answer, friend. I'm afraid that your visit here is gonna uh -oh. be permanent. Uh, hey. The gun came out of the frame. Oh, made a woman with an attitude. Whee. Dang, we're just uh we we cut. This is an easy to fail have. conversation. Uh, no or we sneaky bribe. Definitely sneaky bribe. We haven't done that yet. I, I hope I hope it's not a problem, but the save game is in this location and hopefully we can get out of here. I got a hundred dollar bill right here it says you like to talk to strangers. Are you a cop? No, I'm no stinking cop. Oh, no, don't say cult. P.I. No, no, no. That, that cult bluff. Cult bluff. I am a seeker of purity who will abide no defect in spirit or form. Yeah, whatever. Do you want a drink? <laughs> you know, we don't right, take American work. Express. Cash customers only. Mm. Uh-oh, now we're back in the whole thing. All right. Try poor and rude attitude, at least. We haven't done that yet. If I had a credit card, do you think I'd be in a dump like this? Boom. Let's see how Bro, she kills us this what time. What are you doing in a dump like this? It's a PI business. I'm a PI working on a case. Yeah, but then we're back Kill to him. the other dialogue. You look tree. like you're working on a bender. And we don't serve PIs. Oh, no, Bluto again. Hey, Bluto! Okay, so she I shoots us or Bluto gets us. Movie. Is there a third yeah. way for us to die? All right, let's so go what? back to Sneaky Bribe. I got a hundred dollar bill right here. Yeah, let's you do... like... okay. Are you a cop? No. I'm... Dig guess... for information. Yeah, dig for information. Looking That's for the last some friends one, of right? mine who came here a while ago. A lot of people come and go here. Uh oh, we're back on the loop. No nonsense. We haven't done that yet. That's not mince words. I'll give you a C note for some information. Put your money where your mouth is, Rockefeller. Okay, so we have to get here. This is this part is it? I think we have to know what the token is. Okay, That's the money thing. bags. Oh uh, right. So ask for transportation, and then let's let's do unprepared. I think it'll get us through. The transportation, and you then the unprepared. Let me check. No, I must be in my other overcoat. Huh. Look. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. I mean, maybe you're one of us, and maybe you're <laughs> go find your token. If you come back here without it, don't plan on leaving. All right. Well done, Margot Kidder. Boy, that must... Uh, that got us out of the conversation, at least. Okay, let's save. And then... Let's think. Maybe one of the things in our inventory oh, is... Oh, we have a chip. We yeah. have a we have a chip in our wall in our watch. Okay, that watch in secret compartment may be the safest place for me to hide the winter chip. But is the winter chip the same as the token? No, that's not a token. That's, no, that's not it. Uh, I have to, we have to walk around a little bit. Why are you back? Why? Well, I guess we can't. The... I'm back here because I want to save in a location that won't kill me in the end. Okay. Of the yeah. Let's look what at the locations. The, yeah. The what? Go, go to the travel button. Travel. Yeah. So, uh, is there any other place on Broken Skull Planet that we can wander around, or is it just that spot? No, just that was the only spot. spot. Okay, what, so... What's the roadside motel? What is that? Yeah, I don't remember that. Let's go there. The roadside... Up high, up left, there, up, up. Oh. There you go. We've been here. Oh, right, right. But, hmm, Colonel's office? 
Oh, somebody, uh, Um Raccoon's helping us. He said, Maybe ask Maybe that. Aztec's girlfriend, and then well, she's in the, the motel. Crotch, the Goodness, old guy right. owes you a favor. I've been worried sick. Ask about token. The chameleon said something about using an old silver dollar as a token. All right, silver dollar. I don't know where you could find one. They're so rare. We'll probably go Maybe. to the electric shop, and uh, and it will be in the the force field case. No, I was going to say the pawn shop, if anything, but... Uh... Yeah, definitely do the pawn shop. I miss that place. What do you want, Matthew? <laughs> exactly. I'm a busy man. Moif. Ooh, new animation. You did a little barrel roll there. What yeah. now, Matthew? <laughs> what now, Matthew? Yeah, I've got a couple of old Susan B. Anthony silver dollars in my Ooh, yeah. collection. They're pretty expensive. I guess pretty I do expensive. owe you something. Okay. Uh, he owes us something. Let's get it. Yeah, I've got a couple of old Susan hmm. B. Anthony Let's silver go to dollars the thing. in my coin collection. They're pretty expensive. I guess I do owe you something. Wait, so he gave it to us? Yeah. Well, that was easy. Let's Jeez. go back. We have to go back. Back to the moon. We have to go back. And let's Did you find what. what you were looking for? Did we ever, sister? Save oh, under wait. a new file. Yeah. Who knows what will happen? Casual yeah. puzzle. It went through the wash, but I think it'll work. Well, let's see it. I haven't got all day. Yeah, that's kind of a ding. Jeffrey is the only one who get who got my reference. Yeah, I missed it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Go knock on that door and say Jax or better. The man you need to see is in there. I walk down a hall and look at the name tag on the door. Feral Puss. Must be a charming Feral guy. Feral Puss. I call out the password and a gravelly grating voice calls loudly for me to come in. As I step into the back room, I'm blasted by an aromantic wave of cigar smoke, alcohol, fish, and body sweat. The combination mm. almost knocks me out. The room is empty except for a bloated hog of a man who seems to be the source of all the foul odors. All right, we got... I ain't seen you here before. Who the hell are you? Oh, boy. question. Okay, choose. So one. you work for the Nazis? <laughs> <laughs> well, That's what they are, aren't they? They're like genetic purity, going to bomb the planet. They're Nazis, right? Yeah, I guess so. Uh, Nazis of the future. The bull in a china shop. I'm a friend of the chameleon. He told me to come here and look for a fat pig named Puss. Well, I guess you found him. Have a sit down, Tex. Hang on. Their guns are ridiculous. No. Mr. Puss, it's not only rude, but it's also illegal to point a Lester flame rod at a total stranger. Ha oh, ha, you're not a total stranger. I've been waiting for you for a while now. Though I thought you was going to come up with that chameleon. So yeah, you're disappointed dead. the chameleon isn't here, huh? Why? Was he your girlfriend? Hell, I ought to blow your head off right now. But I ain't going to. Sick burn, thanks. Watching you sweat. <laughs> You know, I bet you do. Probably makes your own body odor less noticeable. Watch your mouth, boy, or I'll blow your damn head off. My boss told me that when you got here, I should take care of you. Now sit down. <laughs> well, great. I'd like a nice tie with two umbrellas and a nice plate of those cocktail weenies. I don't think so. I think you wanted me to slit your throat. But there ain't no sport in that. So I'm going to give you a chance to beat the odds. <laughs> Where's that like fish every, smell coming from? Oh, I've beaten a few like odds in my time. Every good villain. I'll guarantee you haven't beaten this. Before I kill you, Mr. Bond. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Here's a very slow laser beam. I call it the Feralette Table. Three of them balls are hollow, and there's a spy drone in each one. 
their little robotic arachnids with nasty stingers. <laughs> Is this a puzzle? <laughs> well, dare I ask what's in the fourth ball? Inside that one is part of a ticket to the moon child. I'll mix them around. Then you just part of a pick ticket. the ball with the ticket and open it up. Do that four times and I'll take you to the moon child. Dang. Sounds like the old shell game to me. Exactly. Except that's usually that's only three. Close enough. Here's the ball with the ticket. Top Let's fuel play. tip three dollars. Keep your eye on the ball. Okay. No, we can't because Daniel's Any there. Ball. Wait, do we pick a ball? You gotta stop moving first, I think. So we'll pick that ball. Oh. James Earl Jones, here we come. Yeah. Finish nice. up this lousy shell game and let's get on with it. Okay, so you have to tell <laughs> us which one you pick, Daniel, because we, we have to be able to watch it. And this is like what they do at Did you Mariner find what games. you were looking for? What? Crap. Seriously? Right. Yeah. Wait. I what? thought you saved. He did. It was just at this point. Oh, this is where it goes back to no matter what? Yeah. No, we'll try we to, to save. give her this every time? Okay. I walk. I'm Let's afraid. Save now. <laughs> You're not a total. Oh, I've beaten it. I'll guarantee you have. Can you save well, now? Dare I ask what's in the. Inside that? No. Mm -hmm. Sounds like the old shell game to me. Okay. Okay. I wonder if the answer is the same every enough. time. Here's the ball with the ticket. Let's play. So how do we know which one the ball with the ticket is? But there's that nowhere one. to okay. save. Okay, right. pick a ball. Okay. Any ball. Okay, so it's... I'm watching. I'm watching. I watch this the Mariner game all the time. Which ball? I say it's, it's this Okay, it's one. the top. No, top right. Top right. Top right. That one. This one? Yep. Yeah. yeah. Totally. Bingo. Okay. Beginner luck. Let's see how you do this time. Oh, crap. I have to do it twice. Which one? Okay, same one. All right. Middle. It's the middle this, one. This one? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Damn it. I guess I need to speed up the balls a little bit. Well, third time's the charm for me. Oh, come three on. times or four. <laughs> okay. Oh shit! I think there was I a frame see. skip there. That was weird. Yeah. So, so you guys benefited from it because the delay over Zoom. Okay, I think it's the left, the one on the left. I think it's the bottom one. Oh, you might be right. I don't know. Well, take it. Daniel, choose. Who do you love? Who do you love? <laughs> Wait, so no, I sing the bottom one? Yeah. yeah. But I did miss something. So oh, you no, might got it. Right. You, get, you got it. Lucky nice. today, aren't we? I can't wait to see a spy drone tear your head off. Ozzy Astaroth no tipped five pieces of eight. Well played, Tex. Real You're really on the ball. You screwed up <laughs> You're really on the ball. Thanks. I no, know that's on. what you have to look. Oh, Knock yeah. it off. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I gotta watch real careful. Oh, oh I'm gone. I'm Screw gone. Screw you. I'm on it. I'm on it. I'm on it. It's on the bottom. The bottom? Yeah. Oh, man. Nice, well Noah. Well done. I was all over that. Damn you, Murphy. I was that they playing this gone. over Zoom. But we did make a deal. I'm taking a few people up to the moon child in a couple of hours. You can go with us. <clears throat> All right. You I saved us. If you weren't here to today, out. we'd be like, Wait this would the be the rest of the, the stream. Drinks are on me. me and Daniel. Going, this would no, be the rest of our lives. That's <laughs> my favorite. Sit down, brother. Have a drink. It's on the house. So she's with the Nazis, too. Yeah. Wait. I thought she was just a jerk. Nazis. Okay, agreeable, polite refusal. Sure, agreeable. Or some, yeah. Thanks. Make it bourbon, neat. So when we leave him? Oh, it won't be long now. The purification will be tomorrow at midnight. What would Clark say? Cult bluff. 
Well, finally, the holy prophecies are coming true. By the way, Farrell told me to ask about the house special. Oh, really? Well, uh, Farrell's always been partial to the house special. Here you go. You drink it all. Sometimes the poison settles on the bottom. <laughs> Okay, traditional... Oh, invite to join in. She's going to say no. Hmm. This ought to hit the spot. Are you going to join me? Oh, no, it's a little strong for me. <laughs> it's a man's drink. Don't do it. Don't do it, Tex. Oh, down you go. Edigans. So, you're Tex Murphy. Well, we're going to make your trip as comfortable as possible. Nighty night. <laughs> oh, the evil cackle. Uh, Superman. <laughs> oh, that was a great game. I'm so glad we finally got through this. Oh, man. Okay, what are we going to play next? Oh, no. It's another day. What? Come I think on. this is the last one, though. <laughs> But it's a big one. The figure was tall and gaunt, and in the costume and bearing of the stranger, neither wit nor propriety existed. There are chords in the hearts of the most reckless, which cannot be touched without emotion. Even with the utterly lost, to whom life and death are equally jests, there are matters of which no jest can be made. I must have died and gone to heaven. Except I don't think people in heaven have raging hangovers. I must be on the moon, child. I have to admit, it is incredible. I could get used to living in a place like this. I've never seen anything so beautiful. Really? What's that sound? Could use a coming little, this uh, way. Color. Some splotches. Some tile. Oh, man. Oh, it's the Cuban. Another cube. It's the Cuban. Wake Welcome up, Mr. to MV Murphy. MTV. We'll have no sleeping through the greatest event in the history of the world. I'm so glad you could join us on this sacred day. Who is this guy? Maybe you don't recognize me. It has been some time. It's Will Ferrell. Lowell Percival, <laughs> at your service. You did a job for me on Mars a few years back. Cleverness, tenacity, both then and now, have shown me that you belong here. In fact, I need to thank you for securing the statuette for us. The flawless crystals and the symbolic purity of the dove are the foundation of our beliefs. Our sacred text has said that our destiny would be secure only if we had the statuette in our possession. We are deeply in your Wake me up when, the com when, when it's over. An hour or so. Bring me we the red pages. Specifically, <laughs> the purification by means of the great alluvium. It is a fabulous name for a somewhat nasty process. Those creative minds at GRS worked extra hard for a long time to make our prophecy a reality. It was quite a challenge to come up with a plan. Get in to match the cube the of monologuing. As it is described in our sacred text, cost me a fortune. Now everything's prepared. The cube of context. <laughs> At midnight, I will become the savior of our dying world. The earth has become a rotting shell, inhabited by a mongrel breed of half humans that infest the pure races with their filthy, mutated okay, just, genes. Just get out of there. What do you want is us to do? What do we need to find? Mankind? The earth must be thoroughly cleansed. Okay, you're going to try to kill everybody. We're going to try to stop you. What do we do next? We'll release the seeds of purification. The seeds of tolerable. purification. The baptism of fire, which follows, will destroy all life on earth. But, but before we do that, I want you to play a game of charades with me. In keeping with the sacred prophecies. Watch this we'll magic trick. Years, he does go on, doesn't he? <laughs> the moon child. Then our genetically pure children will return to a world that, like them, 
so get me out of this cube of exposition i can't stop so I and then we will make america it. great again i will die peacefully <laughs> knowing that i have given mankind a purified world i can't stop giving exposition I this hell. oh my god to the the ark of humanity but it is also a splendid place to spend the next 40 years we have it all here Aquariums, aviaries, zoos with animals, Mini golf. Mines, forests, rivers, mountains, <laughs> nightclubs, ballparks, everything you could ever want. Water and parks, people. slides. Only the creme de la creme. Architects, bankers, doctors, artists, musicians, and the former president. And as for the women. Uh, women, women, women. All beautiful, intelligent, accomplished. Women will be chosen for their sexual men, prowess. Women and children, all bound together by belief and purpose. A desire to create a world free of imperfection. A society of harmony, peace. Without right, I'm going to finish my taxes, you guys. You just let me know when it's... Uh, animals to be bred and slaughtered? You have less than an hour to decide. This is crazy. What if the game ends after his monologue? But I'll be down to see you. <laughs> well done. You listen to me. I'm sure you'll agree that you're off. You win this time. Limited? Limited. Wait, what did he say so again? What was what? Can we just listen to some? Oh, wait. Here's, his <laughs> offer is tempting. It sounds like paradise. And there's probably no way to stop the cult now, so maybe I should just make the best of it. Hold on, Murphy. Don't forget what they've got in mind. They intend to wipe out every person that doesn't have to meet their Fred standards. underscore PJ tipped five pieces of eight. Like Please, this. God, make him stop. Never be part of their <laughs> we went from I've one monologue to, to another. Them, but I'm going to need some help. He's in the cube. Get Maybe him Sean out of the cube. Alive and I can find her. The two of us might Thanks, be able Fred, to PJ. figure something out. Maybe it's too late, but I've got to do something. Or do I? Maybe I don't. I've got to do something eventually. Uh, that's good. I looked through the pockets of my overcoat, but they've taken everything. All I've got left is the watch I found at the Countess Mansion. Could be a lot worse, though. At least they didn't find the winter chip. True. So we gotta take everything. I got it all. Okay. Wow, that's are we like, uh, <laughs> supposedly day six is actually somewhat short. Now we're not going to get through it. It's 153, but I have a feeling we'll, we should have whatever we play next lined up because i don't think the next stream is gonna take long to get through this <laughs> he says <laughs> with uncharacteristic yeah. optimism yeah we're on chapter six of this live stream is it is there it's only six right no i'm saying that we've streamed six times yeah to get exactly. all the way through to day six yeah okay Go look for things to pick up. Do, let me see Daniel do some classic pixel hunting. Wow. Before you joined in, Noah, there was some weird pixel hunting that I just... Instead of turning no, right as I usually do... Instead uh -huh. of turning turning right as I usually do, I turned left and there was something on the wall and that was the key to the cabinet. This arboretum is like... Very good. Oh yeah, something right at the, tr at the tree there. Shiny at the tree, at the base of the tree. The base of the tree. That looked like I thought I saw no, something. Um, turn slightly to the right. Slightly to the right. Okay. Move You're forward. talking about the, the thing next to the tree. Yeah. Th oh. Yeah, it's a knife or a... Wow, it's a, a it's a 2D something. It's a rake. A 2D rake. Yay. I bet you there's more to be found. Wait, what's this? What's that thing on the left. There it is. Yeah, right. Keep going. Keep going. No, it's just weird texture lines oh, that get messed yeah. up whenever I. Red underscore PJ. Gotta look for something to use that rake on. Some you open that, open that door. Is that, the, is that the only door? Is that the door that we... Wait. Does that take us back? to the menu? Yeah. I see you're back again. What? Wow. 
Come on. Did we save? Yeah. I looked through the pockets of my... Yeah. Go get the rake. That's... So... Okay. If in we gotta floor... look at the rock walls. Oh, there's some stuff on the walls there. Okay, get, go get the rake again. Do we have... Okay, there it is. Now let's check the walls out. It says, Um Raccoon. Pay close attention to the rock walls. I I really want to read. Oh, reviews. right there. What's that thing? Oh. Nothing. I really Some want to read reviews of this game. Oh, from magazines. those are some rocks. To, those rock. The oh, rock these are walls. these are the rock uh, walls. Oh, there's something. To the, turn to the right. Something oh. right. This. Yeah. yeah. You're right. It's a flint. Is... Keith right. Flint. I want to read reviews of this game from magaz computer game magazines from 1994 to see what people actually thought of the controls. Hey, oh. there's another thing. There it is. And You're right. Wow. Good eye. Because the thing is, even for me, that I've been used to playing with keyboard and mouse for several decades now, these controls are horrible. So for people in 1994 who weren't used to playing with the mouse and the keyboard at the same time, I presume it was horrible. Even more horrible. Hey, there's another door. Yeah, I noticed that earlier. I think we're going to get killed if we go in there. Let's try it. Yeah. Throw a rock in there. Let's save. Okay. Let's save. Open. Oh, Ooh, there we go. Oh, that's All just right. a closet. Okay. With a, good, some good baking enough. soda. No, it looks like lighter fluid. Now, if we only had a match. It's a random place can, for well, lighter fluid. We've got we a could only use flint. a piece of flint on a stone. Got a piece of flint and stone to start a fire and lighter fluid to start a fire. And a rake. And a rake to make a torch. A rake? No. Well, there was know. a pile of leaves on the floor to the right. Where, where, where? Ah, oh. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. All right, let's start the fire. We didn't start the fire. We're going to start the fire. Ooh, sound effects. It's been smash, always smash, smash. It's been always burning since You got to use the uh use the rake with the leaves somehow. Really? Yeah. You think? That's what you do. Okay, I used oh, the rake on. I used the rake on the leaves. The rake is gone. The leaves, no, the the leaves haven't moved an inch, so we're good to go. What was that? Oh, <laughs> all right. His name FMB. is John Cena. <laughs> <laughs> Before he he uh, started working out. But <laughs> oh come on! Oh, is he gonna burn up? We <laughs> grab. He just turned burst. How into is flame. he hiding behind that column? Come on! What an <laughs> idiot! Oh. oh, nice. I do enjoy Texas' silly sense of humor. To take the gun? Are you crazy? <laughs> All right, it is two o'clock. It's a perfect place to stop, and we definitely got to our goal today. So uh, let's perfect place to stop. And we're in. Is it only day six, or is there a day seven as There's well? There's a day seven, but it's like the epilogue, I think. So. Oh, okay, so this is <laughs> you got you got I the other spoon back. Yeah, you gotta bring him back. Where yet? There you go. There, uh, there he is. There he is.
Um, Sideshow Bob feels his pain. Well, we seem to have come back a little bit towards the way the game seems like it's found its way back a little bit. No, no, uh, no one's joining me on that one, huh? Well, I mean, um, I, it's it's kind of turned into a Bond movie, but otherwise, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it got very... The MRS place is where it kind of felt a little... The GRS. Well, I think I maybe imagine, that was. I, I imagine you were getting pretty tired of getting chased by that robot drone. Yeah, aimless beam. Maybe that's just more Andrew's navigate uh, navigation. Uh, Daniel's navigation of the uh, of the yeah <laughs> of the room. I I'm the problem. <laughs> <laughs> wow. And that wall safe really threw you for a loop. You couldn't find that wall safe to save your life, and it was right there. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. And you got us through. Uh, well, Daniel did a great job on piecing the, the piece of paper together. Spoonie nailed the uh, the roving balls. The what you call it? The the, the shell the, the game. Shell game. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, let's just say some thank you to our donors today: Jeffrey, Top Fuel, Jwex, Tommy, Fred, PJ. Ozzy Astroth and Doppelganger at Copview Art. Thank you guys. Appreciate your support today. And we're going to do one, one spin. Yeah. One Two spins. Spin. Get one spin. One spin. Good luck. Oh, we got the sound effect today. Nice. Come on, person who's going to eventually win. I'm rooting for you. Oh, it's looking like Copview Art. Like right smack metal Copview Art. Yeah. All right. Nice all right. work. Well done. We reach out to Daniel or Discord. And he has a bevy of wonderful games that you guys can talk through and you can choose from. All right. Well, uh, Noah, when we when we play more games together, is this time now that our time is different than your time? Is this going to screw you up at all? Or no, not um, at all. It's I, I'm I'm going to make double sure to check time.gov. That's the uh... <laughs> good idea. Well, thanks for, for coming. It's great Set having you again. Yeah. Thanks, Daniel, for navigating this game. I'm sure it's you make it look easy. And I think it would probably it's probably kind of a pain. It is a pain, but uh, we'll suffer through it together. We'll suffer through it together. OK, cool. Anything else? Anybody anything before we go? No, yeah, no just thanks I... everyone for watching and thanks everyone for having me. So uh, yeah, I'm, I'm well, always glad to be here. Yeah, awesome. thank you now thanks. for joining us and, and join me on Sunday for my conversation with uh, Prince of Persia creator Jordan Mechner. Yeah. That, on Sunday. Dan, Daniel's awesome tech talks. Always worth your four and a half hours of viewing. Ah, it's a short one this time. It's just two and a half hours. Whoa, that is one of your shorter ones. That's it's crazy. a TikTok video at this stage. <laughs> So let me All ask right. you real fast. This yeah. this gifts game is very heavy on green screens. You didn't deal much with green screens on Phantasmagoria, did you? Just the oh. last chapter. The last chapter where he goes into the threshold. That was all green screen. And that was always intended to be green screen. I think they just hoped it would be a little bit more. They, they blew through so much of the money that I think their green screen budget ultimate, and, and their sort of uh, CGI or whatever it was back then uh, there wasn't that much left. So it was, it's not a very, uh, uh, I would have loved to have seen what they originally had in mind for that, for that world. Mm -hmm. But yeah, but yeah, I didn't have to do much. I only had to do that one, one chapter, which was enough for me. But Hey, we got to see a head in a, a head in a, uh, water cooler. We got that two heads in. Yeah, that's right. How many games have heads in water coolers in them? Do you think? Not many. There's two. We know of two. All right. Take it easy, guys. Have a good one. See you on Monday. Thanks, guys. Bye. <sighs> that was good timing.